Jan and Ben here at the U.S. Coast Guard Academy. It's essential that there is in-person education because of the training and military preparedness that's necessary. So they borrowed an idea they heard about from the U.S. Air Force Academy. With the lab's equipment and expertise already in place, all base personnel needed Whatever was Coast Guard to approval to conduct their own COVID-19 tests. Starting in August, we began testing about 2% uh, of the population every day, 15% a week through surveillance testing. Surveillance meaning a pool of tests. The Coast Guard's goal, find those who are asymptomatic. By testing 15% a week, Statistically, we're going to be able to catch any outbreak that's kind of emerging without um, symptoms happening. The Coast Guard Academy's positivity rate, certainly the envy of all schools and communities. Our positivity rate has been very consistently well below 1%. Um, which we're extremely happy with. Since the beginning of the semester, over 3,500 tests have been administered with only two positive results. This is uh, one of our 3D printed swabs. Which they make with this 3D printer to supplement their supply chain. We know that the work that we're doing has a greater purpose to ensure that the mission of the Coast Guard Academy can be completed. And when the cadets leave campus for several weeks in December, they will take home saliva COVID testing kits. So we're really excited to be able to use and leverage this new uh, um, resource to add another layer of uh, security and safety to make sure that our students are safe before they travel back for the spring semester. So far, it's taken uh, less than $100,000 to pay for this testing for the U.S. Coast Guard, and they say they have enough resources in place to take this testing right through the spring, but you can, uh, or mid-spring, but you can bet that they will take it through the end of the year. We're live here in New London outside the United States Coast Guard Academy. I'm Tony Terzi, Fox 61 News.